Well, I spent most of the afternoon doing a bunch of busy work. I put a magnetic snapping together type of uh, hanging screen over my uh, side door to my garage. I've never been, a, never had really good uh, air inflow from outside, especially from the shady side of the house. And that's the si uh, east side of the house. And so in the afternoon, the shade is completely engulfing that area. I also bought a, a fan. Let me show you. It's a tall fan, but it's, it's not all that tall. And my car is a little too close to the door, so I can't get it fully open and position the uh, fan just a little bit more forward over the uh, hood of the car. But... I'm pushing the air up and uh, it'll circulate into the studio, cooling it off a little bit, hopefully. These uh, windows, all three of them, face south, so that sun in the summertime just boils in here. And uh, I at least stopped it from boiling in over there where I work in my studio. And uh, well, it's time to get back to work on my clay. It's, little time as I got left for this afternoon, I'll do as much as I can. Time to play with some play. The side of the face that I did yesterday I had just a little too much uh, muscle showing. It's the horse is not being, it's not straining. He's just standing there, relaxed, probably chewing some uh, grass that he's whatever in his mouth. So he would have would be using these muscles here, but this these muscles here wouldn't be as strained as w if he was running and breathing in heavily and stuff like that. So he's more relaxed on this side than he will be, um, or more relaxed than he would normally be. This uh, silicone tool I bought oh, probably three years ago, maybe four. It uh, broke right here. And I've tried several glues to try to get that... Uh, glued together because it whenever I pressed on it, it would flip back I can still see the crack but I used this uh, Gorilla super glue and It's so incredible. I mean everything that I've tried has failed but this glue fa uh, actually worked on uh, gluing that silicone together which is unbelievable so it really does glue everything. I've, I've glued tools together. I've glued mannequins together that broke. I used to have to send off to get fixed at the uh, found or at the uh, uh, the uh, oh, what do they call it the people who made the thing. I've been able to glue everything with this super glue. Uh, the stars on the flag of the uh, warrior. Uh, and the captured flag, I used this super glue. So I highly recommend uh, this uh, Gorilla Super Glue. Just unreal. Well, it's the next day. I tried to get busy on this clay yesterday, but just ran out of time. Uh, by the time I got done doing everything I had to do, it was uh, 5.30 and I eat at 6.00. And, uh, and I gotta fix my own meal. I don't have anybody upstairs working for me. <laughs> so, uh, it's Saturday. I usually take a Saturday off, but I figured I want to work on this horse's head today and try to get this as far as I can today. So, let's get doing, be doing it. I just stuck my reference up here and I put a little fondue stick through the uh, print into the clay doesn't harm the clay I can fix that easy 
and then I can have my reference right there already at my fingertips. Now the key is to make the eyes on both sides exactly the same. Let me tell you, that's not easy to do. <laughs> But I'll do my best. Now these are silicone tools I bought several years ago. The person no longer makes them, I'm sad to say. But uh, you can make your own. Just have to do a little research. And uh, there are videos on YouTube that show you how. You just have to search them out. Sometimes you get too much light on a subject and by turning off one of the lights, and I'll show you, you can see detail better than with both lights on. And basically that's all a sculptor is, is shaping shadows.
again there's no strained muscles so I'm not gonna define every muscle but I'm gonna put every one that has to be there and then I'll smooth it out a little that's what's form that's what forms the shape of the face or the muscles Alright, next time, next week, I will uh, tilt the horse up a little bit so I can work on his uh, under jaw and uh, his front lips. This is a hard angle to work on him. But that's going to be it for today. And I'll pick this up next week. I'm happy the way it's turning out. It's symmetrical, and that's the key, is not to make one side thicker than the other. you got to have them symmetrical in their shape. Hope you guys have a wonderful rest of the weekend. I'm just going to relax and catch my breath. Good night, everybody. Give me a like and a subscribe and ring the little bell. Also, don't forget I have instructional videos available now online. The link below this video shows you a link to a review of all nine videos. Later, everybody. Good night.